Second time in as many years and just the fourth time in program history, San Diego State University is in the Sweet 16. And this time it's personal because of who they're playing. NBC7's Dana Williams is in Boston as the team prepares for this big matchup. Good morning from Boston. We are standing right outside of TD Garden. This is typically where the Celtics play, but come tomorrow, it's where the San Diego State Aztecs are going to take on the Yukon Huskies. It's the first time it's a rematch in the making since the Aztecs lost to the Huskies in last year's championship game. And the travel is going to be a big factor here for the San Diego State Aztecs. It was a long travel day yesterday to get here, but for Yukon, it's just about an 85 mile drive. And so there are a lot of Yukon fans who are expected to be here tomorrow. Head coach Brian Dutcher has already said that this is going to be a game played in hostile environment. It's something that the Aztecs have done and succeeded in before, but all eyes are going to be on that, not to mention the Aztecs were just in Spokane two days ago. We have a very exciting day ahead of us. We get to go into the arena in just about 30 minutes. We get to talk with the players, go into the locker room, watch their practice and UConn's practice. And we are very excited to be here for all of the Aztec faithful who couldn't make the 2500 mile journey here to Boston. For now, reporting from Boston, I'm Dana Williams for NBC7. And if you didn't make the trip and you're looking for a place to watch the game, how about Petco Park? The Padres are inviting fans at tomorrow's opening day sellout to stay after the game for a watch party. It is only open to people who have a ticket. And you'll also have to have a ticket if you want to go watch the SDSU watch party at Viejas Arena. That is for students and season ticket holders.